Honorable Principal Mushtaq Amanoum, esteemed resource persons, person Professor Manindra Nath Thakur, Professor at Center for Political Science, JMU, another esteemed resource person, Professor Ravi Ranjan from Department of Political Science, Zakir Hussain Delhi College, keynote speaker for today, respected Dr. Hashmi Bal Khan from DTC Kulgam, delegates from various colleges of the valley, uh, Mr. Shami Azgar Ali, scholar from JNU, and other faculty members from the host college and my dear students, Assalamu alaikum and a very good afternoon to all of you. I feel honored to have been asked to propose a vote of thanks in front of such an august gathering. First of all, I thank Almighty Allah for successful and smooth culmination of today's seminar. Now I would like to convey my sense of appreciation for our worthy principal who always extends every possible support and cooperation needed for such uh, programs. Thank you sir once again for also delivering the welcome address in which you warmly welcomed all your guests from outside the valley as well as inside the valley. My deep sense of gratitude goes to a esteemed resource person, Professor Manindra Nath Thakur, who in his enlightening presentation shared his inspirational stories and that too from unheard and unrecognized writers and poets. So we are highly thankful to you for your intense research on your home in Kashmir. And you also intend, so we are again enlightened that you intend to do more research on our homeland. We also thank you, sir, for instilling our younger generation with a hope for a practical and humanistic revival of concepts like freedom, justice, love, etc. Once again, thanks for advising us to delve deep into the fathoms of knowledge to get ill in the real sense of the word. And once again, I, sir, I don't know, unconsciously, you gave literature students a mirror field for research while we can talk about or we can do research upon unheard writers, unheard poets and we can get the implied ideas and then try to recre recreate and do research on them. So once again, thank you. Now it's time to express my special thanks to another resource person, Professor Ravi Ranjan. Thank you, sir, for deliberating upon the theme in a very unique and marvelous style. So as a literature student, I think that we were more in a national seminar on literature because as Islam said, very well said that it was as if we were only listening to short stories, anecdotes, poems as if we were in a literature class. Thank you, sir, once again for creating such an environment. And once again, thank you for deliberating upon the concept of Muslim society, particularly in the Indian context, and we, which we all think that is the need of the day that we need to develop such kind of ideology. And once again, sir, thank you for beautifully connecting. Like Maninda, sir, you very well beautifully connected the history with the elm and that to that elm which will make humans more humanistic and which, which we all agree that this is what we need where we are having, we are losing our values, we are losing our ethics, we are losing our human values. So once again, thank you, sir, and also for gracing the occasion fire by your presence. Thank you, sir. Now my deep sense of appreciation goes to Dr. Hashim Iqbal Khan for delineating the history of our development of Indian civilization and saving through so many, through so many innovations, movements, ideologies, etc. And also, sir, thank you for elaborating upon the aims and objectives of today's one-day national seminar as a keynote speaker. And sir, once again, thank you for apprising us of, of the real labor revolt of which we were not aware of that in 1865, it was actually the uh, labor, uh, this revolt of uh, what we call those handicapped artisans. It was actually that. So first, may we always celebrate as a labor's day. We observe it as a labor's day, but everybody was not apprised of this thing that actually this is what we need. Actually, we need to recognize such things. We need to uh, get those people or get those heroes on the forefront who have really contributed. But this, And this is what we feel as an individual we have to contribute and what we have to work upon. This is what I could get out of it. Thank you, sir, once again for your valuable comments upon this theme. And now my uh, thanks are also due to our uh, scholar from uh, JNU, uh, Mr. Asghar Ali, uh, Shamim Asghar Ali, sorry, Asghar Ali. So I think I will call him a historian with a camera 
as uh, Mandusra also said that he always is taking the photographs. So he is an historian, living historian with a camera, and I hope he has captured each and every still of this program, and it will get an international coverage, and it will be a future guide for all future generations. Thank you, sir, and a warm welcome to this Valley and Tor College as well. And my wholehearted expression of gratitude goes to all the delegates from different colleges of the valley and to all my dear students without whose participation such programs are not possible. And now my big chunk of thanks goes to the head department of public administration, Dr. Muhammad Shafi Bhatt, for organizing today's national seminar. And a special thanks are also due to ICSSR for sponsoring this program and making it such a great event. Once again, thanks to ICSSR. And my special appreciation and thanks to all the committees and departments who were involved in the organization of this seminar, particularly with special mention of uh, debates and seminar committee, Com department of computer applications, hospitality and protocol committee, technical and infrastructure committee, and all other allied committees who made this program a grand success. And my special thanks also goes to all the faculty members, te non-teaching members, who one way or the other way helped us and assisted us as in this seminar. My special thanks are also due to Professor Isaka Madhwani, Head Department of English Language and Literature, for presenting all inclusive seminar report. And it would be sheer injustice if I won't express my gratitude to Dr. Mukhtar Amirdar for wonderfully moderating all the sessions of today's seminar. Thank you, sir, once again. So let me conclude with the hope that today's seminar shall open the very shut windows of our imagination and vision to see life from a very, very pluralistic, humanistic and practical approach. And we shall all try to get the great lessons from history so that the blunders are not committed once again. So once again, thank you all and may God bless us all. Thank you. You organize it with heart, not with mind. <laughs>